My decent day. We're up into the middle of September here. We're just gonna go check out a few places and see if we can get up all the way up to uh, Arrow Lake. Right now we're down by the the old border. Go for a little ride. Chicken on the road already. up here, see if we can get to a falls. place to ride. I know from looking at Google Maps there's a, uh, a little swamp crossing that we got to do if we can do it. Depends how deep it is. get close enough that we can actually do a little hike to the falls. It'd be kind of cool. The falls are right on the, uh, the Pigeon River, which is the border crossing between the U.S. and Canada. I don't know if there's a trail in there or not. today. Everybody else chickened out. I said that it might be a deep water, heavy mud kind of ride and they all started crying and uh, bailed so we'll see what they missed today. Big something just flew over there. Oh, we got a big beaver down here. It's a 
someone actually drove their vehicle in here. <laughs> For what reason, I don't know. That's a big dam. Big damn dam. Ditches along here. The hawk. We got a dead rabbit. <laughs> That's why he's there. these little mountains on this side and we got the river down on the left down in the valley I guess we really can't get lost but I'm sure I could just goes and goes and goes. Got all these little holes in the ground here and there. still going the right way. Hard to tell. I finally figured out how to use my, uh, or how to get to the track on the GPS. I'm still learning this new GPS. It's pretty good actually. Draws me a nice line. turn down to uh, try and get to the falls. If we can get there or not, I don't know. We're going to try. Man, I can't tell if I'm yelling in this mic with the, the pipe on here or not. waiting to hit a big hole in the grass here. Boom. Still got a nice base for a road here. Not like it's all washed out, turned to mud. Actually pretty wide. This is all wide the old road used to be. Got like a little something in the bush there. Must be a camping spot. It looks like an outhouse.
leaves are starting to change on the leaves, looking pretty cool. But that just means the snow is coming. <laughs> Probably heard me say it before, but I don't like winter. nice in here. Going down into the valley. The valley of the unknown. Obviously an old cut road at one time. see the uh, the reds and oranges we don't get them up where we are we either got to go east or south to get them we're down south of town quite a ways right down the border well, we're getting grown in now I guess some people ride this trail. Obviously, it's the beaten path. Somewhat. to tell it was once a road in some places but uh, four wheelers have been down here so that's where we're going Venture in. Muddy. Ooh, only about three feet deep, but muddy. My lights are on. I gotta put the blue lights on. All right, we're gonna give her a shot. Okay, here comes Chris. Oh, nice. From <laughs> Darren, 650. Oh, he wants to rip it up so we can't get back through. <laughs> unknown territory. There still looks like there's quad tracks in the grass here, so we might be onto something. Bunch of poly here. There's not much of a road. There is four wheeler tracks through here though. Oh boy. Oh boy. Somebody's been 
Ravens are here. Just ended. Well, that, that is no good. Alright, so as you can see, we still got a ways to go. Uh, we didn't get as far as I thought we would. This gets all grown in and pretty much impassable. So we'd have to hike uh, pretty far. More than I'm prepared to today. So I guess we're going to turn around. And we'll go up the other way, see if we can get across to Arrow Lake. All this plastic here, somebody must have uh, had a moose shelter or something here. Probably hunting the swamps. And we're back to the water crossing. Looks like we're gonna get some blue sky here, maybe. Nice. We're back into the autumn scenery. They cut right up between uh, the pass there. I don't see any road though. This uh, zigzag back up, but it doesn't. I thought this road might go up through there, but it doesn't. Unfortunately, that would have been really cool. Now we're gonna go try out this road here. Apparently, according to the GPS, this gets down close to the river. I'll see what we can see down there. We're in the valley here. You can see the hill on the other side and the hill back behind me. Looks like a truck went down here. Wide tracks. It must be uh, moose hunting or deer hunting or something. I think archery is open for them this weekend. Not 100% sure though. 
I see a lot of people going out hunting now. It'd be at least cool if we could get down to the uh, Pigeon River, right on the border. Can wade in and uh, the U.S. Border Guard will come chase us down. Looks like it might be a challenge. This is an old road, but you never know it. I think it's that way. We're going to get anywhere. And it's the end of the line. That is the end of the line. 